John Davis. Well, hello and welcome again to Motor Week. We're glad to have you with us here on Speed Vision. When Saturn first started marketing cars, it promised us not only a new line of uniquely built automobiles, but a new way of doing business as well. And after 10 years and a modestly expanded lineup, they've largely succeeded. So now for 2002, Saturn is branching out into the growing small sport utility segment. And once again, they've made a bold promise that their SUV offers a new view on the concept of small sport utes. So is that view really different? Well, that depends on whether you mean different by Saturn standards or the standards of the rest of the auto industry. To the folks at Saturn, the 2003 VIEW Sport Utility Vehicle is simply a logical extension of the philosophy that has produced the most innovative members of the General Motors family. But by the standards of other automakers and even some other GM divisions, this is not quite your run-of-the-mill sport ute. Like Saturn cars, the view is built on a steel space frame with polymer body panels. This eliminates the need for protective lower body cladding and gives the view a very clean look. The long hood and bull nose with its smoothly integrated headlamps, high mounted fog lamps and wide open lower grille is familiar, like a cross between a Saturn sedan and the view's main competitor, the Honda CR-V. While the tall tail actually reminds us of the Mercedes-Benz M-Class. But VIEW rides on a 106.6-inch wheelbase with a length of 181.3 inches and a width of 71.5 inches, all measurements significantly stouter than competitors like CRV and Toyota's RAV4. And unlike those offshore utes, the VIEW offers a choice of engines, both also used in Saturn's largest L-Series sedans and wagons. To start, GM's global Ecotec 2.2-liter dual overhead cam in line four with 143 horsepower and 152 pound-feet of torque. Optional is this 3-liter twin-cam V6 rated at 181 horsepower and 195 pound-feet of torque. Transmissions include a 5-speed manual or a new high-dramatic developed continuously variable transmission for the VIEW 4-cylinder. The V6 engine is equipped with a new adaptive 5-speed automatic. VIEW is GM's first use of a stepless CVT in America and only its second 5-speed automatic. Both front and all-wheel drive versions of the 4-cylinder VIEW are available. Traction control is optional with 2-wheel drive. The V6 is all-wheel drive from the get-go. The all-wheel drive is a light-duty on-demand system that's similar to the CRV. It uses a G-rotor pump and multi-plate clutch pack to transmit engine power to the rear differential only when needed. Up to 69% of the engine's torque can go to the rear wheels on four-cylinder models. On V6 models, rear wheel torque is limited to 57%. We had our first chance to drive the VIEW during its national press introduction. Despite limited time with the four-cylinder CVT, we were impressed by its silent, seamless operation. Saturn projects 7 to 11% better fuel economy for the CVT as compared to a typical stepped automatic, and we think that could be conservative. As for the V6, we've praised the smooth, torquey V6's performance in the L-Series, and the view is no different. But made it to the new 5-speed automatic transmission, it becomes even more refined and flexible. On steep grades, the adaptive programming works wonders with none of the jerkiness and hunting for gears so common to older automatics. Brakes are unremarkable. Disc in the front and drums in the rear. Like most of the small utes, ABS is unfortunately not standard. The VIEW rides on an all-independent suspension consisting of struts and coil springs up front and a three-link trailing arm set up in the rear. It gives the VIEW a very balanced, car-like feel with reasonably long wheel travel. There is the expected sport ute understeer in tight corners, but body roll is moderate despite the use of relatively soft springs which deliver a comfortable ride. The part of the view that you ride in is a well but not opulently equipped interior that is comparable in size to the Ford Escape and Mazda Tribute. The dash layout is clean and user friendly. Controls are large and clearly marked as we expect from a Saturn and for that matter most GM vehicles. Safety options include head curtain airbags which provide protection inside and rollover accidents and the factory installed OnStar emergency locator system. The front seats are a pair of well-padded buckets that support the back well but offer a little too little side support. The rear floor is perfectly flat with a 70-30 split bench seat. It folds easily and locks into place. 
cargo space is a reasonable 30.3 cubic feet with the seats upright, and it's easily accessed through a big hatch and a very low load floor. Plus, the front passenger seat folds to accommodate cargo up to 8 feet long. Of course, it doesn't matter how much it can hold if you can't afford to buy it. Not to worry, like most small utes, the front drive four-cylinder Saturn view starts with a very reasonable base price of $16,835. Add the CVT transmission and the price steps to $17,775, while all-wheel drive pushes it up further to $19,370. Go whole hog with the all-wheel drive V6 and five-speed automatic and you pay a still competitive $23,085. So from price to power to practicality, the 2003 View offers buyers all the familiar cues of the small sport U class, yet with its space frame and polymer skin construction, CVT transmission, and unmistakable styling, it also offers something quite different. Different enough, we think, to draw more than a few buyers away from the sea of CRVs and RAV4s, and that's saying a lot. Indeed, our view on the view is that it's pure Saturn, a conventional yet unconventional SUV from a brand that understands exactly where they're headed.